Hello YouTube, my name is Abum and now I will continue about creating application Visual Basic application with MySQL First thing, I want to show you how to download and install MySQL Workbench and in this time, I will download first and after that, I show you to install my SQL with my SQL you can create a lot application with visual basic maybe like this and now open your browser and type my SQL okay here I go to first link my SQL.com and maybe here you must choose mysql community server and in bottom you will see the current version 5.6 and i choose windows microsoft windows and i choose this and you will see two version one above uh, download version you must have connection to install uh, and second option offline install and I choose second option and I click download here Okay, now you see this pic. I click no thanks and I want to download my SQL open. Okay, I have a file and I just double click my setup. Okay, like this double click your file you have download now you see like this and install product you must check accept license and execute click execute again and okay this is checking process update and like this press next I choose development default and neck again press neck again and uh, okay like this and execute and here some file will be download from server and you must wait until this process finish okay I have a finish and I press next again and here configuration and press next and you have like this and next again now insert your password retype your password and press next Okay, press next again. And now the processing. Next again. And second process here.
Oke, okay, press next again and finish. Now your computer have MySQL Workbench, and this is a display from the software. Okay, next I will create table. Okay, open your MySQL workbench and in first I will show you how create a new connection. Okay, I go to uh, first connection in installation. You you have a connection and choose this, choose that. And here in server, go to server and choose user and private, maybe like this. And here add account, okay. And type your login name, maybe vp dots an, maybe like this. And here localhost localhost okay localhost password maybe one two three four five six and here one two three four five six and this is a uh, login standard localhost and password apply now you have a uh, this if you go to home close and click plus button here now can add new connection maybe vp to an and here uh, vp to an and test connection you must add a password one two three four five six and press ok ok and now if you test connection you have like this press ok again now I have the new connection if I click this I must insert password I don't want insert password again in here and I type my password one two three four five six and check in save password in fault okay press okay now I go to this scheme vp to en okay now I create database and maybe uh, vp vp app Okay, maybe like this and apply, apply. Wow, error. Okay, I cancel here and okay, I close my connection. Don't save and I go to first connection again. My first connection again and go to server user and private. Okay, and choose VB to an your connection and go to administrative rule check all and now you have all access access okay maybe like this and apply now if you go to okay close this and choose your connection again and now create a new database and maybe vb app apply apply now I have a create a successful okay like this and finish okay and you have all database here if I go to user and choose this and administrative scheme entry any scheme and okay I use VB 
app and press ok apply ah sorry I must close the connection and choose another connection and server user profiles and scheme and add entry selected VP app press ok ok and apply wow ok select all ok like this and press ok and now if I close my connection and go to the connection ha sorry ok now go to first uh, connection again and go to server user and prefills and choose VP tools your connection your new connection maybe and go to administrative rule and here uh, uncheck all okay like this and apply now if I close this connection and go to my connection I have just VP app because in this uh, is in this setting okay I close this okay I go to home and if I go to here I have in scheme profilance I choose VB app and you can add entry like this you can select scheme and you will show to your connection okay maybe like this and okay I cancel this I close my connection and now I have a connection and I have a database here now I create a new table create table and maybe first I add admin maybe to user login and here admin in column name maybe number and here I need ENT and PK like this primary K not null unique and anything and I don't need this I need this okay auto increment and primary K okay like this first I need number and ENT now I need a uh, name name for user login maybe okay 45 and here not null and now I need password and varchar maybe 45 okay maybe like this number name and password okay I go to apply button and you have code like this and apply finish okay now I need a new table again okay I have a admin table and right click create a table and I need maybe category category uh, sorry category okay maybe like this and here I add number and ENT primary key and auto increment and here maybe name name of category or maybe category maybe like this and okay maybe 45 okay and I type here not null apply apply again 
finish and third I need again create a new table and here maybe uh, to tutorial maybe like this okay tutorial and first I need number number ENT auto increment and not null no and here title maybe title and okay I need maybe a hundred fifty and not null here and maybe I need YouTube code YouTube ah sorry YouTube and here I need maybe uh, 15 okay maybe like this not null okay I need three table okay apply apply and finish and admin I need insert new data just type here maybe admin and password maybe one two three four okay this is name admin and password apply apply finish okay I close all and now I need a category insert right click select row limit and here I add maybe after effect and here 3d as make and here photoshop okay maybe like this and okay maybe be sonar and flash and trim before okay maybe like this press apply apply finish now I have a category and admin here admin category and tutorial in first I need data in category and admin next video I will show you how to connect to MySQL database with Visual Basic 2010 Express. Okay, see you in next video and thanks for watching. Goodbye.